Welcome to EdTech Hustle. My name is Rich and synthetic video is everywhere these days, but these videos do take a little while to create. So I'm going to show you an awesome new marketing tool called Replique that will let you create synthetic videos from a spreadsheet. I'm going to create 20 videos in just a couple minutes. You can probably create even more in less time. So the first thing you want to do is to sign up for a Replique account. So I would not sign up at this website. Instead, look at the screen, go ahead and use the link bit.ly slash edtech hustle, all in lowercase caps for a special offer on Replique. Once you click on that link and you sign up, you are ready to create videos. Okay, here we are at my dashboard. There's a lot of different options that you can use, great options for marketing that you will want to check out. But what I want to do right over here in the top right is this option, create an AI avatar using your photo. So this is the screen that will come up. What we're going to do is to create a video. You can kind of see it here to the right with the avatar in the corner of the screen. Now, if you want, you can upload a photo of yourself. So you are the avatar, but if you don't want to, you can also select one of the pre-made avatars that are included. I think I'm going to take Elon right over here and then select next. Now, this is where it gets a little confusing. It's not hard. It just takes a little bit of preparation as you can see Elon moving over there in the right hand side. What we're going to do is to create a personalized intro. This is just like a one second greeting. We're going to get into our pitch next. You'll notice right over here that these are the variables and I'm going to show you in one second. We're going to have to upload a spreadsheet of all of the videos that we want to create. Okay, here it is. It says, hello, first name. How is everything going over there at and then the company name? I'm going to show you that in one second. So now what I can do is select the voice that I want to read. So you can see you have a number of different choices here. It's obviously a male. I need to pick a male voice. Hello, first name. How is everything going over there at company name? Okay, let's go ahead and test this one out. Hello, first name. How is everything going over there at company name? Just so we have another one, let me go ahead and uh, let me try uh, Ken. Let's go ahead and test this one. Hello, first name. How is everything going over there at company name? Okay, so I'm going to keep this nice kind of Australian voice and I'm going to go to the next part. Now, this is where we are going to add our pitch. So a couple different things you can do. You can either write your own pitch right over here from scratch, or we can use this option right over here where I can create a prompt using ChatGPT. Let me try this one. Pitch a new marketing app called Replique that helps marketers get more leads. Okay, so here it is. This is the, uh, okay, so here this part is. Here is the pitch that I've added here. Now what I'm going to do is to select next. And this is the part where I will then need all of my leads on a spreadsheet. Okay, so here it is. You can see the different columns I have. I have a first name, a last name, company, title, and website. These are what we are all going to use inside the pitch that I'm going to create in a second. So what I can do is to select this option, I'm going to import that spreadsheet. Okay, there it is. You can see right over here, this is the spreadsheet. It looks good. I'm going to select next. And it's just going to ask me to match everything up. So you can see that the website is going to go under website URLs. We have first name, we have company name, job title. I just have it under title. And I don't have an icebreaker. I'm just going to leave that the way it is. And I will select next. Okay, so it will let me know that it looks like I have three of the uh, entries that you can see. It says it's not a valid URL. LinkedIn, Facebook, Crunchbase are not available for avatar backgrounds right now. I'll just take those out, I guess. Spotify too? Yeah, I guess. So I'm just gonna take those out. So we have 16 out of 20 instead. Now I can add more from here if I want, or of course I can always add it on my spreadsheet. Now you can do way more than this. This is the only amount that I'm choosing to do for this demonstration. I'm going to select submit. It's going to go through, it will process all of my data and you can see some of the options. It's going to create a website and I can really customize this on here if I would like. You can see you can change the video title, the inch, the description 
Uh, you also have some other options in terms of what you want some of the buttons to say. A little bit of options for you to customize, which includes uploading your own logo. But I'm just gonna leave this the way it is. Let me go ahead and select Start Video Creation. And let's get this process underway. Okay, so as you can see, our file is now ready. Our 16 videos look like they're good. Let's go ahead and preview them by clicking this button. Okay, here is the first video, of course, to Tim Cook. Let's listen to a few seconds. Hello, Tim. How is everything going over there at Apple? Introducing Replic, the game-changing marketing app designed to skyrocket your lead. Okay, now let's try this one. How about Netflix? Hello, Reed. How is everything going over there at Netflix? Introducing Replic, the game-changing marketing app designed to skyrocket your lead. Now you'll notice one of the things that it does, which is kind of cool, is it does put the website that you selected in the background, which I thought was kind of cool. Uh, let's try one more. We'll do Canva. Hello, Melanie. How is everything going over there at Canva? Introducing Replic. So this kind of gives you the idea, right? You can put an intro and then you can add your pitch and you could create this synthetic video. So you can go through and you can listen to each of the different videos that you've created. Like I said, it was ridiculously easy to make this. Now there's a few different ways that you could do this. You could copy the video HTML code and you can share it. Uh, if you can't embed it in an email program, I know I, I use Outlook and you can't really embed email into Outlook. It will also create create a brand new URL for you right over here. And you can share this by just sharing the URL uh, through the link. There's a way that you can share it in email or you can also go in and download the actual file, okay, that you're looking at right over here. Now, the other thing you can do if you ever want to just like hang on to these, there is a way that you can go back over here. We can download an entire spreadsheet. Okay, let me go ahead and download that spreadsheet like so again the website is called replique you can create a number of different synthetic video pitches if you are interested in replique what i'd recommend doing is going to bit.ly slash edtech hustle all in lowercase go ahead sign up if you could use this link it would really help me out a lot thank you so much for watching this video if you have any questions or any thoughts on replique leave them in the comments section below